now we discuss the concept of ubuntu installation process two way to install the ubuntu in your system first way using cd rom or the second way using image file that is iso file in these two ways you will follow the same step when you install the ubuntu but only one different in a first way installation process with the use of cd in a second way installation process without the use of cd instead of you using image file if you are going to install the ubuntu with the help of second way you need another one software that is virtual drive software i will explain the second way Here I listed some major image creator softwares. Windows supported these major softwares. For Linux system, Gen ISO Image and ISO Info softwares are used. For Mac OS, Disk Utility and Roxyoto softwares are used. MK ISO FS is applicable. Windows, Linux, and Amiga system. we see see about the virtual drive software so many softwares are available in the internet i list some major uh, virtual drive softwares first one is daemon tools it's only for windows xp system second one is daemon tools pro it's only for uh, windows 7 system third one is magic disk and the fourth one is virtual clone drive and win xp virtual cd control panel is only for a windows xp system not for a windows 7 and uh, alcohol is also called uh, alcohol 52 percentages i will use magic this as a virtual drive softwares I used a Windows XP as a desktop environment. This is a normal DVD drive. It's not a virtual drive. Now, I am going to install the virtual drive software. Magic Disk as a virtual drive software. Now I am going to install this software. Press next. Destination folder is must as your wish. Press finish. After the installation. The icon of the virtual drive is so like this in the taskbar. Now I open the my computer. This is the virtual drive. First one is normal DVD drive. Second one is virtual drive. Now I am going to mount the image file into the virtual drive. Right click on the icon. Select first option, select no media, and select mount. Select the image file of the OS in your computer. After mounting, the screen is so like this. Using this track, you must install the Ubuntu except Windows Drive. Using this track, you must install the Ubuntu inside the Windows Drive. you learn the concept of ubuntu installation process using this track 
you must select any one track from first to two tracks i'm going to select the select second track there are six steps are available i installed the windows xp in c drive according to the second track i must install the ubuntu in c drive here there are five drives are available c d e f and h according to the second track i must install the ubuntu in c drive installation size as you wish desktop environment only one environment language here so many languages are available i will select the any one language i select the english username and password is very important don't forget this option select the install option it will take 40 seconds time to complete this process here two options are available first one reboot now second one is i want to manually reboot later i select the first option and press finish button it will take less than 15 minutes time to complete this process
here two option will ask username and password are the two options Now you type the username and the password. It's already you mentioned when the initial stage. Now we enter the Ubuntu environment. That's all about the concept of. Ubuntu installation.